This is Glenda Gray. She's the president of the South African Medical Research Council. I hadn't seen her for years, when in late 2019, she approached me to make a film about a revolutionary antibody technology that finally could lead to a vaccine for HIV. There's a cure for children, it's called AZT. Back in the day, Glenda and I met through our activism around the HIV pandemic. The pharmaceutical companies must give it to us for free. 30 years on, it looks like science is finally going to be able to defeat the virus. Most successful vaccines are against diseases in which ultimately the immune system clears the virus. Don't want to do that with HIV because you know that natural infection doesn't induce a good immune response. So you got to do better with HIV. This man is important to the story. The world is facing a medical emergency far graver than what we have experienced in over a century. So we're filming a good news doc when COVID-19 comes along and upturns all our plans. Every night I wake up in a panic attack. It's a matter of time before the avalanche comes and we see this huge tragedy unfold in our faces. Now, all the people I'm following are on the front line of a new pandemic. I feel extreme confidence in the safety and the efficacy of this vaccine. Good evening. And thank you so much for your time, Riyadh, tonight. And even I find myself leading a movement around public health. We've relied on big pharmaceuticals to provide this supply, uh, and, and it's simply not good enough. This is becoming a much bigger story, one about pandemics that we're just not ready for. Uh, almost nothing was done to uh, change our uh, relationship uh, with each other and the landscape. Uh, in such a way to bottle up or box in these pathogens from spilling over in the first place. Soon, it's inevitable. Deep conflicts arise with the political class over public health policy and following the science. Professor Glenda Gray has come under fire for labeling government's risk-adjusted strategy unscientific. Biden wants to lock it down. He wants to listen to Dr. Fauci. You dumb bastards, they're not lying. Take care of yourself. Yeah. You, you too, too. Stay, stay safe. safe. I will. Thanks. We, we need, need you. you. Thank you. Thank you.